Amigos, I'm the Spanish chef Omar Ali Boy, and today I'm going to show you how to cook Lubina a la Donostiera, which translates as Basque style sea bass with fried garlic and paprika. Donostia is the Basque name for San Sebastián in northern Spain, and the culinary culture there is quite extraordinary. They are not just famous for their pinchos, these little tapas that uh, they put on top of slices of bread with a toothpick and they sit on the top of the counters in bars, but as well for the traditional cuisine. In that neck of the woods, they rely on some of the best produce you can find in the world. I was going to say Spain, but really it's in the world. Fantastic mountains and of course the Atlantic Sea or the Cantabrico Sea as we call it, uh, which is that, 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 that sea that sits between England and, and Spain. It has a particular name for us, not just the Atlantic. It's too big, too wild. And the seas are really wild in there and they have fantastic fish as I was saying. So Sivas is very popular, we eat it quite frequently across the entire Spain and this is a dinner that is really popular everywhere, in the homes more than in restaurants. You know, my mum cooked this dish, my wife's mum cooked this dish every time we go there. So I can see that it's the simplicity and the quality and freshness of this dish that has made it so popular. But without further ado, let me run you through the ingredients. We're going to need a whole sievers, some flat leaf parsley, chili flakes, garlic, Spanish onion, pepper, sweet smoked paprika, a bit of salt, extra virgin olive oil, some waxy potatoes and cherry vinegar. First, we're going to start by peeling and thinly slicing the potatoes, which we're going to parboil in some salted water for about eight minutes so still completely undercook drain them from the water and we're going to line them as a bed over parchment paper in an oven tray drizzle a bit of extra virgin olive oil over the top and if you can brush them with a brush so that the oil spreads completely now thinly slice some onion rings and place them over the potatoes before seasoning it with a bit of salt and pepper and this will be the bed for our fish which we're going to ask our fishmonger to clean it for us as you can see they remove the inner parts of the belly but I am cutting with a pair of scissors every single fin that the fish has as well I'm going to be doing some cut some incisions straight into the loins so that the heat penetrates and cooks to perfection. Lay your fish over the top of the potatoes, season with a bit of salt and pepper and again just brush it with a little bit more oil and bake it in the oven at 220 degrees for about 15 minutes or until it's ready. Mine was 1.2 kilograms and that's what it took. While that happens, we're going to start preparing our sauce. So peel and thinly slice your garlic, finely chop your parsley, and on a small saucepan over medium heat, pour your extra virgin olive oil with the garlic and the chili. And when the garlic starts to get golden, add your paprika, fry it for 15 seconds, add your parsley, drizzle it straight away with your sherry vinegar, and pour it over your fish. While it's still really hot and sizzling, it's very much the Basque version of a French meunier. And to me, a lot better. And a little bit more parsley for good luck. You saw how simple that was. Probably one of the most common ways of eating fish in Spain, at least in the households. And uh, which is what I'm going to be doing right now as I have a very hungry family to feed. If you enjoy the recipe, please share it with your friends, subscribe to the channel, watch my next videos, and if you are interested in the recipe, please go to my website, thespanishchef.com. See you again soon. Adios, familia. If you enjoy the video, please like it, share it, and subscribe.